if we expect to hear from God purely from God we need to be willing to wait waiting is God's formula of separating chaff from the real things waiting is a formula that Jesus uses to separate goats from sheep God knows that a goat can never wait it is too rebellious to wait goat when I was in Nigeria we waited for prophet for more than seven hours the church he said i want to see my people they told us okay we need to wait from half past three three o'clock four five six seven eight nine ten eleven o'clock that's when he came that's a full day prophet tb joshua when he came breakthrough we receive listen I've never fallen anywhere but I fell that day I know I make people fall but they, that day I fell when I woke up I was looking for my Bible saying, when I arrived in sunrise I said it's time for revenge the whole church was on the floor I said yes what they did to me I do to them now there was breakthrough on every side because I honored the prophet you know as a person you need to learn to know who you are at what time and in which place when i arrive in nigeria i become a baby i behave like sunday school i forget that i'm a prophet of god i conduct myself as a sunday school the one that has to learn because now there's a senior prophet now i need to do what to honor him and humble myself as a result i become blessed so when you come in the house of god though you are a husband in your house immediately when you enter the yard you are no longer a husband become a child of god David was a king but before the presence of God he became a child the Bible say he danced in a manner one of his wife went and said ah, why do you disrobe yourself in front of people the Lord cursed that woman this is called a principle of functioning we don't know who to be at what time and in which place that's why someone will be a ceo at work when they arrive in the house of god they want to be treated like ceo listen ceo is in another company when you enter the house of god you lose your title you are a soul like anybody else only jesus is superior you know why i don't attract lot of rich people in this church because they fail to understand the secret because you are rich when you come in the house of god you want a special chair we will put you next to your laborer yeah a person you see that they can be your helper in the house in this church they will deal with you because you lose what title 
When you get in the house of God, immediately you pass through the gate of Ayen. If you are a mining manager, engineer, it remains at the gate. It will wait for you there. When you are inside, you are a soul. When you get out, you can take your title. That's why this church has been here for seven years. And people who have money are very few. And even if they've got money, they don't want to spend the money here because they want to be worshipped. And Prophet Aaron doesn't worship any man. I remember another man bought me a car. I was driving with him. We were going to the mountain. I was telling him that you are a fornicator. And the car was one week old. I said, you are a fornicator. If you don't stop this, you will go to hell. I said, you, you are a fornicator. Wherever you go, your trousers fall in his car that he bought for me I said to him if you don't if you've got a problem I can get out and I can give you your key where the truth is spoken and it is taught in its intensity normal Christians do not want to be present. You know what are we looking for? Our generation. We are looking for motivational speakers. Not for men who are driven by the spirit to tell us the mind of God. You know you will be praying God speak to me, God speak to me. When you arrive in the house of God and prophets start to tell you what God is saying, you are offended, he is your enemy. If you was on profile picture, you remove him. If you had a calendar, you put the calendar down. Or you buy a big watch, you put it on top of the calendar. Those are Christians. Normal Christians. But we've got others who press on for God regardless of pressure. These are type of believers who does not mind waiting for God for 10 hours. Oh my God. Let me come to you. Hey, listen. You, you are coming here to meet Jesus. Hallelujah. You are coming here that Jesus must talk to you. If you can come here and wait on this altar and sing the whole night, if I don't come, Jesus will not talk to you. Jesus has always used a man to talk to man. Listen. When the children of Israel in their slavery for 400 years, they said, God, come and rescue us. We are destroyed by the Egyptians, our slave drivers. God sent a man. God always come to us to talk to us riding a boat called a man so you waiting for me three hours you're waiting for God who is talking to you now it's not Aaron it's God inside Aaron you need to be able to differentiate there's a difference when you pray that God must come, he sent Moses. When they pray that God must rescue them from the Philistines, God sent Samson. When they pray that God must give them leadership, he sent David.
our problem is that we are short-sighted you need to have a discernment to see God in a man tell your neighbor you need to have discernment to see God in a man you know if satanists can come here in this church now and we give them sitting to sit the sides the whole service they will be on their knees because what they see in this man is not of this world listen to the words of Elijah if you cannot see me being taken away you won't get it if you can't see beyond the body and structure you will miss God I remember we went to a funeral in Limpopo there's an old woman she said she's born again she said prophet I am sick one eye cannot see I believe that if you can touch me I will see I said do you believe I said I believe I see, when I look at you I see God I say very well but in a funeral I've never prayed for anyone if you ask me to pray for you I'll tell you no no you are blessed there's another woman I was with brother Eddie we met her in the garage she went to me man of God I saw you on TV can you pray for me I said to her if you have met me you are blessed you are blessed I would have just prayed if I was another person. God said, this woman believes. She's not trying to steal miracle, but she believes. She manifested. We left. Later on, she called my wife. She said, hey, this is a miracle. This eye normally around 7 o'clock, it starts to pain. I can read the Bible without glasses. Because she believes listen why because she saw beyond the structure the day when you see this thing you receive it you are concentrating too much in the packaging and you miss the content tell your neighbor you are concentrating too much on the packaging and you miss what? The content. The content is more important than the packaging. Goliath wouldn't have fallen had he seen beyond the packaging if Goliath would have looked deeper he would have escaped his death the Bible says he looked at David he saw weakness because the packaging of David looked weak he said you are a young boy you are short you are small you are walking a park that was his end listen to me I'm talking to you sent by God what you are looking for in your life God have hidden it in this body you are looking too far that's why you can't get it hey, you are waiting for me to have 10,000 people following me before you believe you will be late 
Sometimes I look at people. They are arrogant They will leave the church. Arrogant about the blessing. Arrogant about the blessing. Half fish are in another church. When they arrive in the spirit, you find the man who can see the spirit. Where you come from, that is the rightful man to give you what is yours. Ababu. He come back. Is more than five, six people who have been told that, hey, listen, the men where you come from, he's carrying your things. But your problem, you are looking at the size of my church. <laughs> no, the church is small. The day when he is famous, when he appears every day on TV, I will sort of believe. Listen, TV Joshua, TV Joshua said something mighty. He said, You don't measure a man's relationship or depth in God by looking at his church he said, there are men with smaller churches who have a deeper relationship than people who have hundreds of thousands of people coming to them but if you can't see you leave the anointing that is deeper than the ocean and you go to a water canal in fact, the colbert is too big. Ah. You go to a ridge. You know a ridge? Mukoro. You leave the anointing that is deeper than the ocean and you go to a ridge. Because you saw what? Following. Listen. People are like flies they can be attracted by anything even a bad smell can attract them listen to pull people is a simple issue you just stage you know why is this church not overflowing because i don't stage everything that happens here is genuine whether someone leaves the crutch whether someone gets healed from cancer whatever everything here is original listen if i want to make this church to have ten thousand people i will just call my evangelist get me 100 people tell them that they will get 100,000 I mean 1,000 each they must sit on wheelchair then I come and act and they stand up the whole of South Africa will be here South Africa doesn't love original South Africa If I want for a following, I will just do a staging. In a space of three months, I'm out of Rasta Mega Minjobe. I start to fill up stadium. But I don't want that. Because hell is real. I said to my wife this afternoon. There are many people who are in the gospel for wrong reasons. I said to her, when I came to preach the gospel, I was working a handsome job, getting a handsome salary, driving a nice car. I did not start preaching because I was hungry. I started preaching because I was born. I'm doing this because I was born for it. That's why when I do it, I have to do it thoroughly. So we need to understand there is two different types of ministers there are those who minister because they want to eat there are those who minister because they want to get rich drive 
have a house but there are those who preach because they are born for this if they don't preach God will take them they are forced this is a calling it's not a professional office 